Hi, my name is Anne. Thank you for joining me for this energy update. I wanted to flip a few cards to get a read from the higher perspective on what was playing out. And these are the cards that were pulled. And what I will say is this is the great divide. I was actually quite surprised initially at this pull, only because I don't get a strong feeling of this energy. Um, in fact, I feel mostly the opposite. So there was a very strong message here, and it continues to be a strong message, and I call it the Great Divide. There is this polarity that is so strong and playing out right now. And that is one side or one, one group of people is experiencing a lot of um, synchronicities, a lot of downloads, a lot of manifestations, and general feeling of joy and gratitude. And on the other side, and I'm not sure I would like to call it sides, but on the other hand, we have this whole um, different aspect playing out in terms of things breaking down, conflict and defeat, heartache and loss. So we've got uh, many relationships breaking up. We have perhaps some things that are going on in the bigger picture that we are not aware of yet. And that is what's coming through pretty strong right now, is there are definitely some things playing out beyond our ability to see. And in terms of personal relationships, they can tend to be right now breaking down as we elevate into the higher frequencies, it does have an impact on relationships. In fact, some fall away because you no longer resonate with the same people. So what is required is to stay in your strength, in your power, and to have courage to get through it. The next card that came up, and I wanted to share this, is the card of hope. And that really resonated with me personally, because that's kind of how I feel my story played out when I look at this um, process that's in front of me there is the break there is the breakdown the tower the 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 conflict the the defeat the loneliness and the healing and the strength you need to get through it but you know and the reason why you continue to move forward is because there is always that feeling of hope and knowing that you are going through this for a reason and guided and protected and loved. So keep that in mind if you are currently experiencing any of these energies in your life. In terms of the greater collective, I do know that we have been receiving an extraordinary amount of information coming to us, a lot of DNA restructuring in the body, but as well this a little bit 
of secrecy. There isn't a lot coming through right now as to exactly what is going on. I think the reason for that is we are being asked to really master the lessons that we have been learning and have been taught over the past little while. And that means to stop relying on perhaps if you're using tools and to start really relying on your own guidance system, your own intuition when moving forward. So a lot of this seems to be pushing yourself through to the next level of your development and not really knowing what that exactly means yet once again. So we are growing and expanding very quickly. The frequencies have been quite high and stable over quite a bit of time now. And what's a little bit confusing is there isn't, like I said, a lot coming in in terms of exactly what that means. So focus on self and live in gratitude for the moments that you are given. So keep an open mind, uh, keep strong. If you're dealing with these situations, realize it is a moment in time and will pass. And that is what I have for you today. Please, if you resonate with me, I would appreciate it if you would subscribe. Thank you so much.